Ryan, thanks for talking to us. Just talk us through uh, that 90 minutes. Yeah, um, it's always going to be a tough game coming to Gillingham away. It's known for being like they're a good side, they're in the playoffs for a reason. And when they've got six foot summer striker, you know what's going to happen. But I felt the lads dealt with it well. We um, restricted them for large periods of the games. We had a bit of momentum at the start of the first and then towards the end of the second. But I felt we defended resolute and maybe we could have won it. You put a lot of effort in as well, so you deserve something out of the game. Yeah, I think going into the changing room after the game, the lads were quite still a bit gutted because we didn't. We felt like we should try and win every game, but at the end of the day, a point's a point in the right direction. And when you come in here, before the ball's been kicked, you take a point. But where you are now in this particular part of the season, the clean sheet as well, is something that you can build on. Yeah, I think if we build on a clean sheet, get some goals and then build the momentum. If, say we do get playoffs, maybe push on for automatics. But if you get the momentum and we end up in playoffs, it's, it's always a good sign. You talk about momentum. How important is it now that you can get on this good run going? You know, a couple of draws, the, the building blocks are back in place. Yeah, I think, you see, the last two games we've... We've um, worked, our, worked really hard to try and get something out of the game and we now need to go into Monday and try and get the three points, especially at home. You're right in the mix for, for a playoff place. Automatic might be a bit difficult, but it's still open. The season's still open. Just for you on a, on a point, you've, you've won promotion at other clubs. What do you think about this particular squad? I think it's got it's got the ability to get promotion. Um, I think the way we, the style of play we play and like, as you can see, like we are fight for each other we never give up give up you see from the start of the season all the way throughout the season we can see that if we just need to try and get across the line it don't matter how you win games now so six games to go three points is all that matters at the moment but a point today the right is step in the right direction and forest green are coming up on monday that's your next opponent that's the game you're focusing on you're going for the top there unfortunately anchored at the bottom yeah it's going to be it's going to be a tough game like every Every game now up to the end of the season is going to be tough, but I think we try and implement our style of play and then obviously build on the result today, we can we can get the three points we need. And the manager thinks, you know, you've been sound defending, he thinks there's goals in the team, there has been goals previously in the team, they're going to come back, are they? Yeah, for just after that, that run that we had during this, this month, I think the lads are still confident, still... We're still creating chances, we still believe that we're going to score in every game. And then we kept the clean sheet, that was important for us to keep the clean sheet. And now on Monday, hopefully, we can go and score some goals as well as a clean sheet. And you're back in front of the home fans as well. The club's been putting the offers on for the mini three match home programme. You're going to be extra crowd there. You want them to get get behind you and get with you. Yeah, the, great. yeah the fans have been great all season. Like they've stuck with us through the hard times, through the good times. And now, now hopefully, we can finish the season well. and. Who knows? Maybe automatics, maybe playoffs. Who knows? But the fans stick with us. Like today, 400 so or so came down from crew, which is a long journey. And then hopefully we can put on a good show on Monday for them.